was addicted the minute I picked up a dumbbell. And ever since then, I haven't, I haven't missed a training session. I haven't missed meals. My, my dedication for bodybuilding has always been a do or die approach. To this day, I, I still learn things every single day in the gym and out of the gym about myself and bodybuilding, the things that I can apply to bodybuilding. You find yourself coming to a point in life, if you ever find yourself coming to a point in life where you think you know, you have no idea. It's been a long journey to get to where I, where I am, but I would walk it all over again. I have no regrets. I never strive to try and be different. I just was different and I wasn't about to mold myself into what everybody else think, thinks is socially acceptable or the norm. That's not really living. If, you, if you're not living in a way that you wake up every day and you're completely happy, how are you living? You know I mean? Is that living? I don't think it is. We have a very short amount of time on this earth and you might as well live it the way you want to live it. I believe in having no regrets. Go hard or go home. That's been my way of life. You know, if you're going to do it, go all the way. If you're not, don't bother. Don't waste your time. And when I got into the bodybuilding world, I had a few mentors along the way and I remember being a teenager and questioning whether or not I wanted to pursue bodybuilding as a profession. I remember a very important figure in my life asking me one question. He said, uh, would you rather live 70 years as a lamb or 30 years as a lion? And I immediately said 30 years as a lion. I knew that it was, bodybuilding was, it was all or nothing. It was do or die.